Hey guys, Sharon Burying Grounds. This is a community burial place containing members of the Children of Peace Builders of the Sharon Temple. Tombstones dating to the early 1920s include that of their founder, David Wilson. I decided to show you, I'm going to find a way in here. It's an interesting um, graveyard, it's got fence over here. And uh, here we go, check all this out. I don't know how I'm going to get in here because uh, they got this thing gated and if nobody's around maybe I can swing it open. It doesn't look like it'll take much to get in. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. So this is it. We were just at the uh, at the temple. Looks like that area there is the oldest. Boy, it's getting dark quick. I'm gonna go quick here. Wow, that's so fantastic. Headstones. And check out this beautiful gate here. This might have been the back way in. This looks like the main entrance. Of course, the road's behind me. What do they got here, a memorial? And there's a whole bunch of headstones all around here. I'm running out of light, guys. Oh, Smith and George Smith. Sarah Downs and George Smith. 1866. Look at that, eh? Beautiful big tree here. I can't even read these. There's just a whole bunch of these little stones all around. The classics, man. There. Um, let's, I have to come here when there's daylight, but we'll just do a little sneak peek here. Boy, I only have a few minutes left. Of daylight, Tate is here. 1912, but here we go. This is going to be the oldest stuff here. And you can see how uh, they have uh, the gate, that gated, uh, segregated area, and they seem to be in their original positions. You think? Check this out, there's a stone here, eh? This is a quick walk, eh? We'll try and see the ones that are obviously 1871. There's a headstone there that broke. Johnson. See that, eh? Wow, there's so many, I don't know if I can have the time to see them all. And look at this, the heads, they planted a tree here. And the tree grew. And look at it, it's just pretty well swallowing up the headstones. It's a unique American flag. It's been placed here, James and Mary Lundy's. Yeah, they got an American flag on that one. And it's a new one. It looks really good. Elmer. That out. Haynes. Oh my god, look how many are here. Let's just go right into the heart of this. I can tell I'm going to be running out of time. I want to find the Wilson gentleman. Briggs, 1821. Look at that, eh? Died in 1821. This is one of the oldest. Uh, look at this. 1813. All around here, eh? 1850. Check this out. There's Lundy. I want to find. Well, there's more Lundy here. Well, look at all the rest placed uh, stones there. There's quite a few here, guys. I Sadly, I won't be able to go and look at them all. I'm going to come back here another time. Jesse died in 1868. 
Wow. Darn it. Some of these you can't make out. on this costume kind of nice. Look at 1831. George Wright. Look at all these. Wow. These would be the followers from uh, 1830. Dennis. Oh my god. Look at this here, eh? The setup that they did here. Where is the Wilson gentleman? Look at that, there's even a, a, a headstone way off to the side there at the back. Oh, it's getting dark. It's Briggs. Died in 1860. Small Briggs. There's a lot of Briggs here. The infant. Speed readers, guys. Yeah, this one here we're gonna have to pause. This is very interesting. This is something else. I'm gonna come back to this one again. And of course, there's all these little ones back here. Look how many. There's a high concentration. Oh, at the back there, there's some interesting ones I want to take a look at. Wilson. Wilson. I think I found it. This is for the wife. In memory of, uh, oh, there we go, in memory of John Wilson, who died uh, March 14th, 1887, at the age of 39 years. Is that 39? Yeah. John D. Wilson. But it's in memory of, you know, it's Wilson. It's, I think it says Wilson on the bottom there. Well, check this out. They got a nice little setup here. Oh, man, it's getting... Uh, there's another Wilson Memorial here. This is Sarah, wife of John Reed and daughter of David. And David and somebody else, Wilson, died in 1853, 49. That's a nice one, eh? And then here, what we got here? There you go. There's David Wilson. This is it. This is the original headstone. Look at that, eh? And you rest here. DW. Wow, this is him. 1866. I'm going to walk around here. A little bit of light left. In memory of Phoebe, wife of David, who died in 1866. They both did. January 11th, uh, January 14th, 1866. And he died in January... 19th, 1866. 19th and the 11th. What's that? Eight days apart. Eight days apart. There's Sarah. There's another Wilson here. Some more Wilsons here. And here are some of the original. Wow, look. Oh, you can't make it out, guys. But it's just the old, old headstones. Oh, well, we're going to have to come back here again. What a fantastic cemetery. John H. Wilson, who died in 1863. There's a few Wilsons. There's Rebecca, daughter of John. Oh, I can't make a... It's not Wilson. Oh, it is. A Will... I don't know if it's Wilson. I'm going to guess. John Wilson. Yeah. Rebecca. And at the corner here, we won't, we won't be able to see it. I can just see through the lens here on my camera. There's a, a stone that's right in the corner. Oh, you can't see it. I can see there's more here. Ah, we can't make it out. Guys, look at that. A eh? beautiful sunset. 
The ground is uneven all over here. Wrought iron fence. Looks like the original. Really nice. Uh, they've taken a lot of the stones here and placed them in uh, like a concrete preserved look at this eh? over oh man you can't see it okay guys i'm gonna wrap it up it just got so dark and uh at least we did see the uh wilson plot the man who was uh got the sharon temple there going take care